We are here to celebrate the passage of, of an effective hate crimes legislation led by Senator Dan, Daniel Thatcher this year uh, and Representative Lee Perry in the House. But it first started action in the early 1990s with Representative Frank Pignanelli, who brought this issue first to the state. Senator Pete Suazo, Senator Alicia Suazo continued the fight afterwards, and I was honored uh, to be a part of that fight for six years as well. Uh, I think it took a lot of time because we needed to bring the community further along. We needed to have more dialogue. We needed to make progress elsewhere in securing the rights and non-discrimination rights uh, for the uh, LGBTQ community. Uh, and we have done that over the years. Uh, having an effective hate crime legislation sends a very clear message that we want a community that everyone is, is welcomed and accepted. We can disagree with each other. We have freedom of speech. But we have to draw the line somewhere. Personally, as someone who is Jewish, um, it sends me that personal message that I am welcome, that my community is welcome. As someone that has tried my very best to be an ally uh, for other individuals and, and uh, communities targeted uh, by hate and violence, um, it's validation that we have been on the right side of this fight for, for many years. Um, and for all of us as a, as a community, what does it mean? Uh, it means that we're making progress, that we continue to become a better, more inclusive, more respectful, more understanding community.